The Pennsylvania Supreme Court is set to rule on whether it will hear a case on the controversial mail-in ballot date requirement. Thanks for joining us tonight for Fox 43 News at 10. I'm Evan Forrester. And I'm Amy Lutz. The high court recently threw out a lower court decision on procedural grounds, which said counties cannot throw out a ballot if they do not have the correct handwritten date. Fox 43's James Corrigan spoke to an ACLU lawyer fighting the case, and he joins us now live to break it all down for us. Well, I mean, it's a case that's been heard now numerous times in a number of different courts. The question is whether misdated mail-in ballots can be thrown out despite being submitted in time. Lawyers for the ACLU of Pennsylvania are now asking the Pennsylvania Supreme Court to make a final ruling. We're asking them to once and for all decide this um, so that all of the election officials in the Commonwealth can comply with the Constitution. ACLU of Pennsylvania Senior Supervising Attorney Steve Loney is doing this through what's called a King's Bench petition filed on Wednesday. This would allow it to take the case despite it not having been filed in a lower court first. This follows the high court striking down a Commonwealth court ruling on procedural grounds stating that throwing out misdated ballots is unconstitutional. There was a strong suggestion from multiple members of the court that they need to decide this issue and that when we come if and when a party comes back with all 67 county boards of election as part of the case that they would decide it it comes as counties are moving forward under the current guidelines which are essentially to accept ballots dated between the day they are first mailed out till election day september 20th to november the 5th is a date which need to be on the mail ballots on the outer envelope and that is in keeping with the pa supreme court previous decision if the PA Supreme Court makes a different decision, uh, if, they, if they hear the case, we will always, of course, follow the uh, court decisions. The argument from the ACLU remains the same, that having the wrong date on the ballot is meaningless since the ballot would already have to have been submitted on time for it to count. There's no allegation that anybody is voting out of time, that they're voting early, that they're voting late. It's the, the, the handwritten date isn't useful for figuring out whether people timely voted. Everybody knows that we're talking about timely votes. Now the Republican National Committee and the Pennsylvania Republican Party are fighting the case on the opposite end. They say that changing this law would undermine confidence in the election, and they say that this law is common sense. And James, what comes next now in the case? Well, Amy, the ball is now in the hands of the Pennsylvania Supreme Court. The ball is in their court, per se, uh, on whether they can decide to hear, to hear the case immediately or reject that King's Bench petition, which would likely mean the case would not be decided before Election Day. In studio, I'm James Carg with Fox 43 News.